Alright, what is up guys? It's the Inspector here and today we're gonna talk about the project called Next Earth. It allows you to buy, own and trade with virtual real estate. Now, this is something I've been wanting to talk about for a while. It's probably the next step in NFTs from JPEGs to actually owning land, virtual land. And I'll talk more about that in detail throughout the video. I will also go through the full process of how you actually buy it and I will buy a piece of land for myself. So as always, we're gonna go through the tokenomics, through their whole economy system and everything they have to offer to kind of review if they're a good project or not. And also for everyone that's wondering, I pick the giveaway winner from the previous video at the end of this one so definitely be sure to stick around until the end so this is a whole virtual world where you can own literally anything any part of the world can be yours but I want to say before I start this video please before actually buying or investing your own money into anything do your own research I'm just here to present you with the facts and show you the process of how to actually buy other than that if you do decide to buy it needs to be your own decision and you need to do your own research with all that being said let's continue with the video so once you open the map you're greeted with this it's a, it's a map of the whole world and you can literally pick any Anything that well anything that's not bought up yet and you can buy it own it trade it later obviously some of the better locations are locations that are also sought after in real life so for example let's go and check out New York City I have no idea where New York City is it's around here but basically as you zoom in and look at how much you can zoom in and here you can pick the tiles you want to buy so each tile has a cost and you can buy up to 1,000 tiles so that's kind of the max uh, you can buy per NFT purchase basically and uh, then if I was to buy this and, and let's say I want this region this is 999 tiles this would cost around 400 BUSD now let's find something a little bit cheaper something uh, that's on a different place maybe so this was totally random uh, let's gonna search for New York this New York City it's gonna transfer me over and yeah I, I was off but yeah here we are a New York City Manhattan Island and let's say for example we wanted to buy a piece of Central Park so let's just kind of see how expensive Central Park is and someone already owns this plot of NFTs um, I think this is not owned by anyone yeah it costs $31 to buy this part of Central Park and it's not been bought up yet so here's what I'll do obviously you can also just buy one tile and kind of make uh, yeah no never mind it's already been bought up we're gonna need to find somewhere else where we can buy our virtual land or if I actually really really wanted to own the whole of Central Park because I think it's going to pop off in value later on I could just buy the tiles off of someone who's already bought them and kind of see what their market resale price is because right now as you can see this has been bought up and I can't buy it now because someone's already the owner of this so the current owner is god mulzu <laughs> that's a good name and the current market value is 280 us dollars or busd but he bought it for 57 so that's quite the increase in price from when he bought to right now but that's because this is central park new york city let's go somewhere totally random in the world and kind of buy i'm not gonna go totally random i want to pick somewhere in europe somewhere here around the france germany area and i'll just zoom in on a random land of plot on plot of land actually and let's just kind of buy you know 32 tiles how much would that be that's six dollars for 32 tiles 0.1 per tile so that's nothing but let's just buy it just to kind of go through the process so I have my MetaMask connected with the Binance Smart Chain and let's go ahead and do this yeah obviously you need to connect your wallet first so let's go to wallet MetaMask yeah I have not connected my wallet I was wondering why the hell is it not working but there we go wallets now connected and give me back my one tile no wait, wait, wait. there we go that's for 6.5 BUSD and let's go ahead and buy this land I will sign with my wallet and this land is now bought and owned by yours truly so while this transaction finishes we're gonna check out my land later on here's the location of some of the most expensive Oh, there we go Infrastructure just went through but the most expensive tiles are in Vatican City where it's $42 per one tile that's insane now we have Monaco where it's $16 per tile and Macau which is almost $4 per tile 
Now, the most popular lands include the United States, Russia, and South Korea. Anyway, I am now the proud owner of this piece of land somewhere between Germany and France, I guess. This is more Germany than France, I think. Actually, no, never mind. France is around here, which means this might be even Poland. I don't know. When I don't see the borders, I just don't know what it is. See, guys? Borders destroy the world. Borders shouldn't be a thing. Right now, I don't know who lives here. I know humans live there, and I like humans, and that's all it should be. But let's not talk about politics. Let's go back into this. If I go to my lands, you don't have any lands. Oh, well, that sucks for me. Yeah, I have one pending transaction, so I'm still waiting for it to go through, but basically this is my NFT right now. I own this land, and here's the proof it's being minted on the Binance Smart Chain as we speak. Now, if we go to the marketplace, as you can see, a lot of land is selling for a lot of money. Uh, mostly it's for one BNB, and this might be South Korea. I think, I, I, I don't know which language this is. Definitely an Asian language, and thinking about how uh, South Korea is the third most sought after country in this app in this game I would reckon these are all in South Korea then again they don't have to be here's the Tesla Airport Belgrade uh, new terminal C for 0 0.5 BNB it's selling so someone bought this and it's up 140% since he bought so he bought for 0 0.1 BUSD but now the one tile costs 5 BUSD and one would think that it makes sense that you know as more things kind of arise as more people buy uh, more tiles the tiles you have are gonna up in value and pretty much it, it is how it works if a lot of people buy close to you then obviously your tiles go up in value because it's searched for more often so just, it works exactly like real, real estate. Also something I haven't noticed, also something I haven't talked about is that Next Earth donates to charity, so an additional $64,000 donated to charity. Until recently, charitable giving to protect the environment was dominated by large national foundations and governments, but today, online crowdfunding is enabling individuals to support environmental causes by pulling their resources together in charity wallets that make their donations on behalf of themselves or their communities. So they really are saving the environment, they really are donating to charity, and they really are helping out the world. In September, Next Earth sold over $640,000 worth of virtual real estate, and 10% of that was donated to charity. So every time they will donate 10% to charity, every time a new land purchase is made, so that's amazing to know. So every time you do buy land, a uh, good 10% goes to charity. Also, I read somewhere that they're gonna have later on, they're gonna have resources in the game, so depending on which kind of land you have, you're gonna have various resources under it, and now that's not gonna be reflected on the real world resources and wh where they're distributed, but it is going to be completely random, so you never know how, how much a land will be worth in the future. Now, I think I picked the second location for a property I want to buy for, I mean, a piece of land I want to buy. That's gonna go here to South Africa. I know where's a city, let me just find a city, there we go, here's a city. I'm not sure if this is Cape Town or not, but either way, uh, let's buy up the dock. Gotta see how much the dock costs. Alright, that's 161 tiles, and they go for 53 BUSD. Okay, that's kind of over my budget. <laughs> now, let's clear this uh, selection, <laughs> and you know, let's just kind of go like this. I'm gonna go for 64 tiles, that's 21 BUSD. Kind of like this plot of land, this, this is pretty cool, it's good to own. Um, definitely, if someone wants to own the whole dock, they're gonna have to buy me up. Uh, otherwise, they're not gonna own the whole dock. So yeah, I'm gonna be one of those guys and let us buy this for 0 0.33 BUSD per tile I'm gonna just confirm and go ahead and buy this land I need to sign with my MetaMask wallet and now while the transaction processes Let's kind of go over the land distribution uh, the products economy and building and then the digital VR sales marketing platform and their Environmental charity which we kind of already talked about but let's just kind of see um, what they are What they can say about their ecosystem and you know all that kind of fine stuff and our transaction just went through Which is absolutely perfect. I'm gonna go to my lands and wait for everything here to update in the near future Virtual businesses will be thriving. We're dedicated to building a global virtual sales marketing and service platform for these businesses. We'll do this by focusing on making the solution mainstream and also by bringing in as many real-world businesses as possible. Basically, these 10 by 10 sized land tiles, aka NFTs, can be purchased and traded, which I've said multiple times throughout this video. A given amount of money after each land purchase will be distributed throughout the system. These lands will carry many possibilities for their owners, from DeFi yield farming through sales commissions to high-level token burning and, of 
course the possibility of rising land values which we've already seen it's definitely possible and it's already happening so the rising land value is already happening and I can't actually wait for the DeFi yield farming and all those opportunities going to give I actually love yield farming and the ownership of these types of lands will be essential when phase two starts so we're in phase one right now which is just the land distribution and people are just buying up uh, various pieces of the world basically products and economy building so basically land will start receiving resources a global economy for crafting product NFTs will be built based on these resources they can be sold traded and manufactured into smaller or larger economic units by combining with other resources so that's the thing I mentioned before every piece of land will have its own resource and that will be totally random so basically the more real estate you own uh, the more of a chance it is you're gonna get something that's a little bit more rare so the finalized product NFTs will be essential for phase three a community voting will will set rules for these resource allocations and methodologies the centralized autonomous organization aka the DAO governance will also decide on the development strategy as well as choose different directions they would like to see in next earth's global economic evolve then they will also have a VR ecosystems and VR land sales and I'm actually really looking forward to that because I'm a big fan of VR or virtual reality technology so basically their goal is for real life businesses to be funded inside of next earth and obviously last but not least their environmental charity after the ecosystem is fully built charity will start taking over staking rewards commission and token burning and by the end of the project the full self-functioning ecosystem will be supporting environmental charity purposes eventually turning next earth into one of the most most ambitious environmental charity funding projects that has ever been created now that sounds amazing so now I know a lot more about this uh, I have my two he NFTs right here and all the links will be in the description down below from their discord to their Twitter and their website obviously my Twitter as well so yeah with all that out of the way guys uh, let's go ahead and pick the winner from our previous video and see who won the NFT so during my last video I announced this giveaway someone will be getting this soul croc so here we go I copied the link from this video all you needed to do was type a comment Saying, give me a croc so what I will do here is pick a random comment if he doesn't say give me a croc I will go to the next comment and so on until we find someone who says give me a croc and the first one to do so will be the winner of the giveaway so include replies no allow duplicates definitely not and let's go and do this that's over 300 comments it's a lot more than I wanted crypto king congrats give me a croc I will give you a croc my man please message me either on Twitter or just leave a comment on this video I will also try to reply to your comment from this video and you know hopefully we'll get in touch and I can send you uh, the croc and let me show you what you want my man let me just open my phantom wallet I just only have one thing on this wallet I don't have any money or anything uh, the only thing I have on this wallet is the croc that you want my man this is a gentleman croc and it is yours to keep so please message me and I will send you right away you will need the phantom wallet so just say it with all the being said thank you guys for watching and I'll see you all next time peace